Welcome to our first short feature video in which we want to introduce you to a single function of our show file. This video is about our overrides section here in the bottom right corner, which will allow you to easily set highlights for uh, solos and so on. For example, you can simply add a spotlight to a singer, even if you use those fixtures normally together with the other fixtures uh, for your effects and also with gobos and the other stuff. In the process by using those overrides, it is always ensured that you get a nice and clean transition even though it's normally not possible to generate a perfect move in black behavior between different sequences. So let us uh, jump right into it and we will move to our preset global section where we can show you how you can simply set up all those override sequences by editing uh, those override all presets. So in order to edit one of those presets, the first thing we want to do is to create our new look and therefore select the required fixtures. In our case, we will simply use a spotlight in our front truss with the fixture ID 1105. And we simply select this fixture and set it uh, to white afterwards. Um, so as you can see, it's white. And the next step for sure is we want to stop all those movements and also open the global wheel up again. To do this, you can uh, simply adjust all those uh, values manually by using the encoders. And if you're not into that, you can simply use our uh, global override base preset, which does all the work for you. And uh, it will give you, as you can see, a nice starting point uh, with open global wheel, stopped FX and so on to create your um, highlight looks. So let us uh, now simply adjust the position of the spotlight. So we will bring it a bit uh, towards the uh, piano, maybe like this. And let's just, uh, yeah, get the zoom a little bit more narrow, uh, maybe like this. And yeah, that's basically it. So now we can simply store this preset and therefore hit the store button and we will override this uh, global override preset uh, number six. After this is done, you can simply clear your programmer and move over to the macros global. Here you will find a macro at uh, pool item 15. So let's bring uh, capture to the left side, which is called uh, setup overrides. And you have now simply to hit it and wait a second. And after this, your overrides are good to go and set up. So let's switch back to our um, show uh, layout B for our command wing setup and simply uh, try what's happening. So we used a slot six, which is already existing in the show file initially with this uh, keyboard guy. So we will use him for our pi uh, piano setup. So let's give it a try. And as you can see, the fixture is nicely um, set to a dimmer value of zero. And after it's in place with uh, the open gobo wheel and the other color, the fade uh, will bring the light back on. And if we uh, deselect this override, as you can see, the fixture is now back in the rig and it's doing the same effects like the other fixtures do. So that is our override section in a nutshell. Uh, we hope you like this feature and for sure you can also uh, use multiple fixtures for those overrides. It's the same principle for all of them. For the end of this video, we want to show you also the function of a fader, which is related to this override section and which is also already present in your show file. To do so, we will uh, quickly bring back in those two overrides. So the one for our singer and the one for our piano. After this, we can move on to our uh, fader section and here you can find a playback master. It is called playback override master and it will give you the opportunity to control the intensity of all those override uh, fixtures independently from the rest of the fixtures. And this means also independent from the fixtures that were normally used together with them. In this way, you get a really versatile tool to set up those highlights. This is possible due to the fact that we are using some uh, group masters virtually in the background of the show file and they are created by using our macro to ensure that this function is working correctly. 
So to get this feature, please check for the latest update. It is available from our show file version 1.1 and higher. We hope you like this feature and if you have any questions, feel free to ask them in the comments. Thanks for watching and if you don't want to miss any future videos, feel very welcome to subscribe to our channel. <laughs>